Birbal Stories The Most Beautiful Child in Agra Akbar was very fond of his grandchildren. Once, isn't Prince Guram more handsome than any other child around? Yes, Jahan Pana. Without a doubt, Jahan Pana. You are silent, Birbal. Don't you agree with me? It's a difficult question, Jahan Pana, for there is no real test for beauty. Why not? Who would call a rose ugly or a crow beautiful? You have a point there, Jahan Pana. You don't seem convinced. All right, we will have a contest tomorrow. Each of you shall bring along a child. I am sure we will then be able to decide which among them is the most beautiful. The next day, Akbar found that the nobles had followed his instructions. That child's eyes are a bit small for his face. And that one, they looks a bit too fat. I still think my Quran looks better than all of them. But Birbal, why haven't you brought a child? Jahanpana, I could not find a child who is perfect in every feature. Give me a few more days. Sometime later. Birbal, I am still waiting. How much longer will you take? My search is still on Jahanpana. Then one day, Jahanpana, at last I have found the most beautiful child in Agra. Have you brought it here? No, I am afraid the mother will not part with her son, for fear an evil eye may be cast on him. We will have to go to his house. All right, I am very curious to see this child. We will dress like ordinary citizens and go, taking only a few companions with them. Akbar and Birbal went out in disguise. They walked for a long time. How much further is it? We have come a long way. Where is Birbal taking us to? The houses are beginning to look more and more shabby and dirty. I hope Birbal knows what he is doing. Finally, Birbal stopped. That's where the child leaves, my lord. We will watch him from a distance. But where is he, Birbal? Why, there he is. All eyes turn towards the most beautiful child in Agra. That child? Is this another of your pranks, Birbal? This is the ugliest child I have ever come across. I beg of you to be a little more patient, Jahanpana. Just then, the child stumbled and fell. His mother rushed out of the hut. Oh, my child! She picked him up and caressed him. My sweetheart, my angel, my lovely one fell down. I'll beat the ground, hurting my moon so. How can she love this ugly child? He is certainly repulsive. Don't you think so, friend? Yes, imagine calling the child a moon, huh? The women jumped up to face them. What? What did we say? Just say it again. We spoke the truth. This child is... Be quiet. There is no need to repeat such lies. You must be blind or stupid. Go and search all of Agra and see if you can find a lovelier child. Go away now or I will give you proper thrashing. They beat a hasty retreat. I understand, Birbal. Every child is surpassingly beautiful in the eyes of its parents or its grandparents.